Hello, sweetheart. Look, here we are again. We're going to do a little gin review. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, it's uh, Italian engine oil. And I just thought that's absolutely fantastic. The little uh, fuel canister, isn't it? Hashtag engine. Okay, we're going to hashtag them. Uh, I don't know what it is, really. I mean, you're just paying for the packaging, aren't you, really? But it is so cute. Uh, 42%, so we should get you fucked. And it says it's sage and lemon. Product of Italy. It's pure Italy, pure Italy. And I do love Italy. I went there. I love it. I'm a little bit Italian. Um, so I'm sure this will go beautifully in my blood. Beautiful Madonna glass, which my sister got me for Christmas. It's got little Madonnas on it. I don't know if you can see, maybe through my eyes. Ooh. Yeah, it smells like gin. That's good. Some people think gin's like engine oil. Got a little bit there. Fever tree, because I'm very posh. Fever tree, Mediterranean tonic. <laughs> Woo! Bit of a fizz on there, dears. Okay then, let's have a little sniffy woo. Hmm. Yep, yeah, just smells like a like a normal gin, really. But we'll give it a go. Ooh, yes, yeah, definitely some lemonade tones. But that's yeah, that's just a lovely smooth gin, really. That's a lovely smooth gin. It's uh, nothing special, really. But it's not like you know, Gordon's is very harsh on the throat, isn't it? But this is, yeah, it's very smooth, beautiful, Italian. You can smell Verona. You can smell Lovers. Yes, it's beautiful. Okay, I would recommend that then. It's got a beautiful novel packaging. You can keep, uh, you wouldn't put that away in the bin, would you? You're going to put that on your shelf, display it. I'm going to have a little sip on this now, okay, darlings? And, um, yeah, probably what's a bit of tipping point. All right, cheerio.